today we're going to be taking a look at this amazing Metal Slug 3 brick building set from Fantasy. That's right, Fantasy with a P and not an F. Uh, built a couple of their products and their sets in the past, namely the Astro Boy stuff, and it was always impressive to me. Obviously, I'm a huge arcade fan, video game fan, uh, and brick building set fan, so this is an absolute win in my book. Just like I said, it, it's checking all the boxes. You got Metal Slug 3, the arcade cabinet itself, you've got some minifigures here on the front. This is officially licensed, so it's not a knockoff or anything like that by SNK. Um, it's got some action features on the back side over 1200 pieces and the assembly time on this is about five to six hours so let's go ahead and see what we have in the box obviously we got the bricks themselves but we also have this super handy dandy instruction manual that is quite thick quite detailed so let's go ahead and crack this open assemble it and see what it looks like mission one And voila, here we have the fully assembled arcade cabinet kit itself. Uh, I gotta say, this thing looks exceptional. It looks like the original Neo Geo arcade, um, specifically the Japanese version, the 1990 version. Uh, here in the United States, we were more accustomed to the big red machines, but this is true and authentic to the original, original release of the Neo Geo arcade cabinets. We got some action features, we got some moving parts. We've got a, you know, a nice little token slash coin here. Uh, a little coin slot here on the front, you put it in there. This folds down, you can pull the coin out. We got two actual functioning buttons. So you got the Neo Geo button layout with the four buttons. Uh, but these two actually function, these two are faux. So the green one itself operates the machine gun over here. So the machine gun will actually go back and forth and fire. Uh, you can take out the bad guy here. We also have a little platform down here so you can put one of the minifigures down here and have them gripping on to to the machine gun and firing away, but I think that was an awesome feature. You can rapid fire it or you can just push down um, solidly. And then we have this little coin door type of thing here on the front, brings down, get your little power up, your weapon accessory from your uh, rescued prisoner, your uh, guy you just uh, saved from the bad guys. And we also have a functioning joystick that does probably the coolest feature on this arcade the scene transition. So you're gonna pull this lever back and it's gonna rotate this platform back here and it's actually gonna shift the background image cards uh, to change the display. So right now we have the SV tank and the desert background, joystick forward. Now we have all four of our minifigures as well as our player select screen that you're used to and the arcade game start. I mean, that is super cool. Like I said, functioning joystick, being able to transition the scene slowly do it so I don't break anything but yeah just back and forth it's very 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 cool I absolutely love that feature the arcade itself is not massive by any means uh, we're standing at a height of right about nine and a half inches and it is about nine and a half inches wide as well and complete depth right at about eight inches so this is something that will definitely be able to fit on your shelves uh, for collector's sake Comes with all sorts of additional accessories for the minifigures. The minifigures themselves look great. You got loads and loads of weapons. Uh, each, each character can have double fisting weapons and these minifigures are actually rather unique and that they're a little more articulate. So I got some waist swivel there. And we also have some hinge joints on the arms there. So the arms can actually go out a little bit, up and out as opposed to the normal standard Lego style where it just goes, you know, 360 degree rotation. Um, absolutely love the way that these all look. They all look, you know, accurate to the character. Um, the platform here, we've all got their name, name plates, 
You got player one, player two, and like I said, you got loads and loads of weapons, handguns, rifles, frying pans, grenades, headset, everything that you're accustomed to seeing in the Metal Slug universe is going to be visible uh, and represented exceptionally well. The assembly process is pretty straightforward. Pantasy does a good job of individually numbering all the bags and making sure everything's in nice, neat order for the instruction booklet. That way you know exactly what pieces you need to open in each bag and you know what order so you don't have to worry about getting everything confused or unboxing just a massive pile of thousands of individual pieces and sorting through you know trying to find a needle on a haystack for that individual piece uh, retail price on this is msrp about 135 dollars but there are some coupon codes i'll put in this video and down in the links below to help you uh, get this at the best bang for your buck if you will um, like I said, no brainer for arcade fans, no brainer for brick building set fans, uh, no issues whatsoever with the build. My only slight critique I would have is in some of the instructions, uh, the color coordination of the actual pieces versus what is shown in the guidebook itself, sometimes slightly off. So uh, browns would look a little gray and vice versa. So sometimes that was confusing and there are Chinese characteristics in the instructions. So there's no English language uh, translations for you so that is a bummer but at the end of the day you're just looking at pieces and it's very very clear and concise what you need to do to be able to piece this together so I didn't really find the language barrier to be an issue whatsoever but I know there's some out there that would probably not be a fan of it but either way like I said check it out if you're a fan of oh, as he goes down if you're a fan of arcade games and obviously if you're a fan of Neo Geo and lastly if you're a fan of brick building sets because this is an exceptionally designed got functioning, moving parts. I mean, it's great. Like I said, I can't, can't talk enough about how cool that scene change is. So definitely check it out. And that does it for this video review. If you enjoyed the content, make sure you hit that like button, share this video with your friends if you found the information helpful. And as always, thanks for watching guys. It really means a lot.